A Vitar. Back in time. Paradise. Bora Bora of Micronesia. There's that little piece of paradise. Ancient tree. My gosh, how massive it is. It's like something out of Avatar. I know. This is the Avatar of the island. Majestic breadfruits. Ancient pathway built by the Polynesians. The produce. Part of your name in the stem of the banana. Tanua! Imagine living like this. What a way to grow up. Thank you so much. That's so kind. I'm on board the first boat. There she is, Miss Caroline Voyager. Day two, Southern Islands, Nukuro. There is the faded channel. Years ago, I was here with my small boat and we had a little accident when it was unloading. Dig right in these waves and current towards that big channel, no motor. Thankfully, we were able to start the engine at the last second and make it through. Here we go. Back to Nakuro. Look at those little motus dotting here. Crystal clear water. The giant clam. Pearl oysters. Going up to Nakuro Municipal Dock. Nakuro is one of the last existing paradise. Like this kind people, funny people, fun loving. And look at the way they build their houses. Seems like nothing has changed here. See any faces here? Danua, Danua! Danua! Welcome to the beautiful island of Nakuro. It's a very rare and enchanted island of incredible people for lifestyle thank you so much that's so kind that looks delicious wow nice welcome in the rain four different varieties of bananas we're in a locally made house with a hand thatched roof all right here we go rain or shine we're on a short timeline we're gonna go catch these videos all at cook house all the cooking supplies, look at these. These are all handmade tents where they bake bread, recipes using taro. There's a modern water catchment system. Look at these all traditional houses. And look at the old wood that they're made from. And these have been here for ages and ages. We've got a breadfruit there. And Nakoro is known for one of the most picturesque and beautiful main road area here's a giant lime in the coral short coconuts all around quiet in the village with just heavy rain bush decorative shrubs look at this the bananas coming up everywhere sugar cane here and you can see those graves The bananas just everywhere. There's only 50 people on this island and there's far more food than they could ever eat. It's just loaded, wow. Stalk after stalk, absolutely loaded with heavy bananas. Look at these. Here's a house that's built with coral rocks on the bottom. Some woodwork. And here's a pine, one of these are Norfolk pines. And back in the day, these were all full of houses here. Whether it was whalers, I'll ask somebody to tell the story. But uh, this is a cemetery. This continues on. We're walking back towards the channel. Look at these beautiful coconuts. This is the short Ninakura I was talking about on my farm yellow and white Tumaria or Tumaria they call it here peek into this canoe house this is where they store oh here's an old canoe 
Here's one of the funny things about the island is that there are these houses out over the water which look like a beautiful comfortable house for sitting but if I'm correct these are the bathrooms nature recycles here's a pig they have on the beach see it's on a run a running line full of coconuts everywhere it's really coming down here with the GoPro seems to be shooting okay there's a waterproof or water resistant lens there's a whole gaggle of pigs ready to be traded or sold it's a great place to get pigs because they're fed exclusively on a coconut and organic diet which makes the meat so fine somebody's cook fire look at this tree look at how thick this tree is this is just Incredible. This tree is called Kitao. And it's great for carving. And it also makes an excellent medicine for the growth of hair. And the seeds. You can see there's a seed up there. Back at the main building. This is uh, quite a surprise. <laughs> yes. <laughs> it was so lovely to see your smiling faces. <laughs> so many great memories we've had here. Yeah. And I wanted to take the opportunity to come and capture it again, uh -huh. share a little bit with the world, uh -huh. some videos and photos. Wonderful uh -huh. to see you guys. Of all the islands that I've been to, I've never seen more smiling faces than here on Nakura. <laughs> I understand why. What a paradise. All handmade homes using traditional knowledge, local materials. There is no hardware store there is no store the store is god's store and mother nature's store and these gentlemen right here they have an unlimited charge card to that store <laughs> old house these are those orange coconuts I kept mentioning here's the church Tanua! Happy holidays, nice to see you. Rick, yes! Last time I was here, each one of these little lots had a house. And here are the stones that somebody had built their house on before very low tech very natural you can see all the stones that they set in they still have some flowers growing out front We're on a real dance against time. Because when those ship boat, ship boats come, they don't fool around. They would love to leave one Menwai abscessa. That's what they call Americans or white people on this. And in Pun Bay, they say Menwai. But they certainly don't get many visitors down here on this sleepy little island but when it comes time to party these guys really know how to liven it up great dancers great polynesian culture They're amazing at weaving flowers and lace
And here, this corner goes by the school. This used to be a big wooden house here. Look at the breadfruits. Right here. Here's a Nicoran friend. Hi, nice to see you. Many years. The island looks great. Everybody's taking shelter from the rain. This is Pandanus here. This orange of Nakoro brought from Kotarai. If I remember, there's even a mango tree somewhere. This is somebody's active area. This is where you might sit and weave gathering place. Oh, this is my friend's house. I think it is. This looks like Joab's house. The way I can tell is from the solar panels. Yes, this is it. This house is well built. Hi, Danua! I'm making a video to share online. And here, rain or shine. We're making it happen. Yeah. Where's Joab's old place? Yeah. It is. Yeah. I had a feeling. <laughs> place where old memories were made. My gosh, look at this, the Hitao tree. It's even bigger. The canoe house. Look at this awesome place. Just to stay here. Canoes. This is where they keep the canoes down here. Look at this. Wow. This is all well kept. Hope to see you on the other side. Okay. When we come back up and open the hatch, we'll come around and see you guys again. Okay, bye. Thank you. Here we are on my best friend's place. It's changed a little, but the ancient tree is still here. This was awesome. Another great trip on the Coro. Every time I've come here, it's been unforgettable. Very, very short trip to Nakoro, but just enough to see some of the beauty of the island. Here are the lucky guys who will be staying behind. Champions of the island. Maybe in a day or two on the way back, we'll get a better chance, some better weather to tour the island. This is a pretty good start. Off back to the ship. In the channel already? Beautiful, special island with so much history. 
I even have my own long personal history here, but you'll find out about that in my book when it eventually comes out. But, oh. Ahi ahi de mahi mahi.